Hi boys and girls, this is Mr. Lentine here with an art lesson for you on how to make a storyboard. And today's story is The Woman at the Well with Jesus. It's great to be here with you like this, and I hope you enjoy it. A storyboard is simply a story told in, told in pictures. And you can see a simple one I made here. We've got a picture right here of Jesus and the woman at the well, a close-up of him talking to her and then him talking about himself being the living water. She's so amazed, and the, um, the apostles are coming back, but she has to go back and tell her people you know, what Jesus has told her, and she did. She told them, she said, He even told me the things I had done, and you must come hear him. And so they came to hear him, and he taught them for two days. And so that was really good. Okay, so that's a simple storyboard. Now here's another way to do it. You could take individual pieces of paper and draw a picture on each one and then put them all together, staple the sides, and you can make a book. That's pretty nice. Or you could take little pieces of paper like that, glue them down on a board that's a darker color, and you draw a picture in each one, and that would be a neat way to tell a story too. You could even add words if you want to. Okay? All right. So let's see how we're going to do this today. We're going to make this uh, story out of simple shapes in one form, okay? So here we go. Let's practice drawing some simple shapes. I'm going to start with a circle. Go around like that. Very simple. Spin your arm or hand around and then touch with your marker or your pencil. You got a circle. Doesn't have to be perfect. Just like that. Then we're going to do a rectangle. Two lines down, a line across, a line across. There we go. Two lines down, a line across. Great. That's pretty simple, isn't it? How about a triangle? There you go. There you go, a triangle. A couple little ovals. Kind of flat ovals. Over here. See if you can guess what this is. Two lines down, kind of a curve. Oval up here. That's called a cylinder, okay? So you should practice all these shapes, a whole bunch of them, for a while until you get really good at doing them, so you don't even have to think about it, okay? Now... Let's draw Jesus. How are we going to do that? What shapes are we going to use? We're going to start off with a rectangle. There you go. And we're going to add a couple ovals. Put a big circle here. Maybe put a sash right here. Give him a couple arms with lines. And... How do we make it look like Jesus? Well, most of the time they picture Jesus with long hair and a beard, mustache, eyes, nose, mouth. There he is. Very simple. Nothing real fancy, but you get the idea. There's Jesus. Okay, now for the well. Draw two lines straight down. Curve, curve. There's the, where the reach down to the water in there. Make the stones on the, the well. A little offset here. That looks pretty good. Doesn't have to be fancy. There you go. All right. And then the woman at the well. I'm going to come straight across here, about the same level as Jesus' head. Make a triangle. Circle. Put a few eyes. Nose. And we'll give her her feet. Uh, give her curly hair so we can tell the difference. Very nice. Her hand. She's reaching over here and she's got a picture that... She gets the water with. All right, so she's talking to Jesus, and Jesus is telling her all the great things and even things that she has done, and she's just amazed. She goes back and tells her other people. So that's basically how you do that, boys and girls. And uh, it's not hard. Uh, in fact, I can go through it real quick again just to show you, okay? For Jesus, a rectangle, his head, draw the long hair. Beard, his eyes, nose, 
Left arm. The massage. The other feet. We are. And for the well, straight down like that. It's not hard. You'll like it. There you go. And then the woman. There's even a song called Fill My Cup, Lord, and it goes like this. Like the woman at the well, I was seeking for things that could not satisfy. And then I heard my Savior speaking, draw from the well that never shall run dry. Fill my cup, Lord, I lift it up, Lord, come and quench the thirsting of my soul. Bread of heaven, feed me till I want no more. Fill my cup, fill it up and make me whole. I hope you like that, boys and girls, and I hope you'll be able to tell a story. Remember, you don't have to put everything in one square. You can put, you know, parts of it, close up of Jesus talking, and just little details. Doesn't have to be big and fancy, just very simple. Tell the story. Great to see you. God bless you, and praise God.